Hi guys, my name is Maddie and this is Maddie B Wellness. Today I've got a quick five minute video for you that you can either do in the morning or the evening. It's got a few different movements in it, a few breaths, and we're gonna do it on either the floor or you can stay put in your bed. So I'm gonna go ahead and lay down all the way, but keep my feet on the floor here. So carefully lay it back down, make sure you guys are comfortable and just do a few breaths here. So big inhales through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. Another inhale. And one more exhale. As you exhale, bring your knees up towards your chest and just give them a nice hug. Hug them as tight as you can. Maybe if you can, roll around a little bit to massage the lower back and just massage up and down the spine. Take one more deep breath in here, big inhale. And as you exhale, drop your knees towards the left. So I'm going into a easy spinal twist here, nothing too crazy because if you are doing this in the morning, you haven't moved all night, or if you're winding down at, at night, you wanna take it nice and slow. So I'm just holding this position for a little bit, focusing on the twist in my spine, keeping my right shoulder on the bed or the mat, and just kind of enjoying this stretch right here. This is supposed to be not only physically relieving, but also mentally relieving. Take a big inhale here. As you exhale, we'll drop our knees over to the other side. So dropping it over to the right this time instead of your left. And again, we are easing into this movement. Try to keep the left shoulder blade on the mat or the bed and just keep breathing. Big inhales through the nose. And then as you exhale, maybe twist a little bit deeper to feel more of a massage in your lower back and or up and down your spine, just depending on where you're feeling this or where you need to feel it, maybe a little bit in the hips as well. Take one more inhale here, and on your exhale, come back to center, and then you guys are gonna have to come up into a hands and knees position, or you can stay seated for this one, just depending on what you can and can't do. So I have a cat and cow for you guys, just focusing on spinal, more spinal mobility, more warm up, and more breathing. So we are going to take a big inhale, drop the belly button down to the floor. So as I inhale, you'll notice my belly button gets closer and I've got a big arch in my back and my hips go up towards the ceiling. Same thing with my head. And then on my exhale, I do the very opposite. So I press through the palms, I stretch out the upper back, rounding everything out, and then inhale and exhale. Inhale, make sure you're drawing your shoulders away from your ears as well. And we'll take about two more, big inhale. And last exhale. Good, do me one more favor, take it all the way down to the mat this time. So go ahead and just carefully get onto your belly, whether you're on the mat or the bed. Keep your elbows near the rib cage area, and what I need you to do is press through the palms and give me a slight raise of the chin like you're trying to get off of the floor. So you're pressing through the palms slightly, drive the shoulders down and away from the ears, and if you can, come all the way up. Get a nice big stretch here. Say hello to Luke. Go ahead and make sure we're keeping our feet on the floor, squeezing the glutes taking care of the lower back. This is a great lower back relief stretch. And then go ahead and take it back down. We're gonna try this one more time. So you have those two options, either just coming up slightly or pressing all the way up through the palms. Go ahead, take a big inhale here. On your exhale, get into the position you prefer, either on your forearms or all the way up, pressing through the palms. Take about two breaths here. And then carefully come back down just to press yourself up again into a tabletop. And then go ahead and find a seated position for me, whether that's in your bed or on the mat. And we're gonna come into a butterfly position. So butterfly meaning the soles of my feet are touching together, my knees are flapping out to the side like a butterfly. <laughs> See? And then I want you to sit up nice and tall and try to make sure that your pelvis is not too tucked under. So a lot of the times when we're doing this exercise, I see a lot of slouched positions, right? We're here. I want you to sit up nice and tall. So 
Try to think of it being a flat, neutral spine all the way from the top of the head down to your tailbone. Press your knees down as best as you can and then hinge forward slightly. See how I went from here to here and feel that stretch of the hips. We'll be here for about three breaths and then we are done with this video, your little wind down or wind up for the day. Take two more breaths here, big inhales, even bigger exhales. Last one. And you guys are finished. Go ahead and take any other stretch that you would like. If you guys enjoyed this video, please let me know. I would love to give you more. And with that, have a wonderful afternoon or morning or evening, whenever you're watching this. Thank you so much. Bye.